Here we go. This is gonna be the weekly race number 22 already. We're playing a map made by uh, Texan and it is called Sector 87. This is uh, a map built in uh, the evening mode, which makes uh, the look of this map very nice with all the blue lights and red lights and all the other lights that are on this map. Um, it is a very nice, uh, well-built map. Has uh, a really good speed part. Tech section, dirt is there in the mix. The RPG kind of trial part is uh, not really existing, but it is uh, somewhat in there in the start. As we, uh, of course, have a uh, small warm-up here in the start. And then uh, we will go live with 21 laps, which will result in about uh, which will result in about 43 minutes of playtime. And we have a full server, 210 people again playing the race. We have a couple of uh, really good players in here. Let's follow Arizal for this first round. see uh, how he uh, does the start which can be quite tricky as you can see the lights here green lights blue lights everything is uh, really colorful Arizel takes a small lead already on the boosters we jump got to make sure your car lands straight as possible here you got to release a little tiny bit so you land early oh Lollar jumps all the way through down and uh, he completely misses the booster will lose a lot of speed and it is Arizel Who is uh, in the lead after this first start section there we see the whole pack driving behind However, Arizel is driving a very good first uh, section we see Hillis His Norwegian teammate actually in second place so the two Norwegians taking the lead here. Oh, Hill is not driving uh, the best line there. We saw Zykos doing a wall bank. And here we go on the long straight section where you can just rest your uh, hands a little bit. Arizel still leading. Zykos and Roa having a little bit more speed. Coming up to the full speed section. Now this is where you need to speed slides in order to gain a lot of speed here. Hillis is not doing them that well. This left-hander you want to turn as tiny as possible. That is a really good one. Gets a lot of speed and momentum. What about Roa? Roa as well. Coming into this big wall and Roa completely flips. Oh, he went down too early and that is a typical Roa. Or should I say Throa? As he manages to fill again in lap 1. Drops down to place 73. Loses 50. I mean, sorry. 5 seconds. I cannot even speak anymore. And that is a uh, huge mistake by Roa in lap 1 again. Arizel, however, oh, has made a small mistake. Drops down. Uh, seems to have uh, done the dirt section a little bit wrong. And it is actually uh, Hillis who is in the lead. Decided to uh, play the race here and is currently in first. And actually driving pretty good. Has uh, accumulated a 1 second lead, which is... Uh, Real nice. As he goes on the boosters here. Lands really early. That is beautiful. There we see the players coming right behind him. In uh, second place, it's Nano from uh, Spain. He is about uh, 0.5 of a second behind. We are driving lap 2, of course. Oh, Hillis is losing a little bit of momentum there. But still holding first. Oh, he actually clips the wall a little bit. He clipped the wall a tiny bit. And Nano is now the leader of the race. We have Shorty in uh, <coughs> fourth place. Where did Shorty go? I think Shorty's game crashed or something. I have no idea what happened. He just disappeared. I guess his game crashed. That is <laughs> very unfortunate when I uh, 
spectate him. We have uh, Masa following Masa here. Oh, has made a mistake in the full speed section. And uh, drops down to about place 9. Is 4 seconds behind. Let's follow him for the remaining of this of this round on the dirt section he goes oh clips the wall at the dirt and uh it gets overtaken by like five people six people even even his teammate roa is uh back from uh the depths was in position 74 after after lab one and is uh, right now in about 14th 15th hanging in that uh place category It is, uh, however, still Hillis leading the race. Nano in second. Papu is in third. So, Papu doing a good job here as well. Ooh, not the best landing. We'll lose a lot of speed. And Pack is actually in the mix also. However, he decided to uh, take a different approach in the downhill. Actually went for a uh, tiny wall touch before going down. I don't think it's faster, to be honest. Just releasing or pressing the brake will uh, result in a much faster downhill section. But of course, Spec is driving and I'm just here watching him do the job. He is currently in third place, one and a half seconds behind. But it's a really close battle actually for this whole top, uh, top 10. It's only four seconds. Even the top 22 is six seconds behind. Let's uh, follow him. Bad Lulu is his name. Currently in place uh, 21st, 22nd, around that area. And it's uh, only 6 seconds gap, so we might have a, a really close race here on this map. Uh, of course, the map is a little bit easier because uh, I think it's just more flowy compared to some of the other maps that we've played. Um, hence why the, the gaps are pretty close. It's only lap 3, though. We have 21 to go, of course. Still a long way to uh, to the finish line. Nonetheless, it is looking uh, really nice so far. All the cars are having uh, a tiny gap between them. So, interesting race, to say the least. Let's take a look at the leader here. It's still Hillis. With a one and a half second lead. That would be something uh, for him to win the race here. I think he has participated in about three races so far. Um, or two. or th Yeah, two or three. And actually his first race that he played, he finished uh, quite high as well. So every time he does play, he, he gets pretty far. That's really good. Here we see Pack again doing the wall touch and it is not faster. If we compare to Hillis just releasing, even jumping a little bit, uh, we'll overtake Pack. So Pack's approach there is uh, completely wrong. Uh, hopefully he will uh, adjust his approach there in the upcoming laps. But uh, this is a really close package here. Pack, Arizal and Hillis, the top three within 15 hundredths of a second from each other. And uh, in fourth place, we have Nano, who is not even far behind either. Only 1.9 seconds. Uh, then the gap is a little bit bigger to Papu, which is uh, 3.4 seconds. So we see a little bit uh, of a stretch coming in here. It looks like Pack is going to overlap a person here. Gravity Guts Guts. Here we see Pack uh, demonstrating those important speed slides in uh, Trackmania if you are driving full speed sections like these uh, the closer your speed drifts the the skid marks are together while sliding the faster you accelerate it is a uh, pretty cool technique in uh, in full speed and uh, back leading the race now one second ahead in front of Arizel Hill is in third, and let's take a look at uh, the last player here. We had 210 players starting the race. And we have about 191 players still driving. 
We have Elephant in last, I think. Or Gabriel. Gabriel from Italy. Buongiorno. Gabriel is in last place here. Let's take a look. <laughs> Banana. Gabriel is not uh, respawning there. He's just going for the full wall bank flip in that section. Uh, let's take a look here. Creeper face 3 0. Is in here. Let's see if he is uh, doing the respawn. Yes, he is. He is doing the respawn. That is Gucci. Let's take a look here. Yuvo driving as a banana. The banana is overtaking some people here. Om nom nom. Has the horn as well. Looking very juicy to say the least. Let's uh, move up a little bit here <coughs> in the player field. We have uh, where, 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 where from the Netherlands. Oh, gets a no slide. I think it's the pressure from my spectating uh, eye. Can he get this drift? No, he can't. He will even touch the wall there, and is now on his way on the long stretch. Here we go. Let's take a look here. Zentog Moon from Belgium. Currently in place 74. He is uh, 34 seconds behind first. First is still occupied by Pack. So not much has moved in the top positions. We will take a look at those players, uh, of course, in a little bit. Here we see uh, the bunny car, which is always, always uh, driven by Yoto Kotokolo. It's his favorite car, I think. The bunny car. Oh, Moon crashes, gets overtaken by a couple players. Let's take a look here. Bergie is uh, playing currently in. 46th position is uh, 22 seconds behind so I wonder what kind of mistake Bergie has made to lose uh, such time oh actually uh, crashes again and uh, loses uh, two seconds almost three seconds actually so Bergie is still in it as he uh, comes up to the long stretch and the full speed part. There he goes. When you're freewheeling in a stadium, you can actually lift off your uh, finger, your acceleration finger from the button. So you can rest a little bit. But uh, here we see Bergy doing the speed slides. Let's see what he does. Oh, he doesn't hold it. And he will lose a lot of speed doing that. Still managing to overtake some people here. Ooh, almost makes a mistake in the wall, right? But still in it. We have uh, Massa in uh, 22nd place. So Massa has lost a huge amount of time here. 15 seconds behind. Wonder where he made a wonder where he made a mistake when he was driving in uh, the top places uh, for the first few rounds. We have Roa in front of him. Oh, Massa clips again in the start. He will, however, make the boosters, of course. There he goes. Roa is right in front of him. Let's take a look at the round from Roa. After uh, making a huge mistake in lap 1, he uh, finds himself in position 19. 
with about 19 seconds of a disadvantage, so... Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Ooh, Roa goes very tight in this hairpin. But uh, let's take a look at the leader of the race. It is uh, still back with a two and a half second lead. It is not that much. Of a uh, lead that Pack has. And uh, let's actually take a look at the records while we're at it. Pack has the best one. 203.38. We have uh, Aurel. Who is currently driving in fourth place. Has a 203.43. So pretty close. And then Flyer. Where's Flyer? Flyer is in 15th at the moment. And he has a 203.58. So pretty good times there by... Uh, by those players and also really close back in first we have uh, Hilleset in second and he is actually driving a really good time here 203.50 that is uh, an impressive time by Hillis he is actually challenging the he's actually challenging the big boys here Ooh, jumps very close there to the to the inside wall is that pack in front of him? Yes, it's back in front of him. And I wonder if Pack is still doing the doing the wall bank strategy in the downhill section. Uh, if so, Hillis can actually catch up a couple seconds there. I mean, a couple hundreds. Sorry, seconds would be uh, really uh, really a lot. But uh, right behind Hillis, we have Arizel, his country mate. Both of these players are from Norway. Here they go on the straight line. This is uh, Hill is right in front of him entering the wall section. Let's see uh, the speed slide. Whose speed slide is more on point? Hill is went for a very wide line, and here comes Arizel. Oh, has so much more speed compared to Hill is, and this is actually really close. Neck and neck we go on the respawn. There he is. Arizel with a tiny bit better respawn section. Let's see the dirt though. Uh, I think Hillis had a better entry on the dirt. This is very close battle. Only pack is uh, three seconds ahead. <coughs> Arizel and Hillis having a very tight battle, but Arizel is driving away with it now. Arizel is uh, in. Oh, Arizel makes a mistake, but Hillis also makes a mistake. And another one, not the best slides by, by Hillis. Oh, Arizel clips the wall again. This is so close between these, but let's move on to Aurel. Aurel is in fourth. He is uh, kind of driving alone here because it's four seconds up to third, and four seconds behind him is Ayako. So, quite a. Uh, Quite a big gap between uh, fourth, third. There we go. It is uh, quite close here for 5th till 12th. This whole pack of players is uh, within 1.5 to 2 seconds <coughs> in difference with each other. On the full speed section. Following Jeroentje. 
As he uh, goes for a wide speed slide. Let's see if he can actually catch up a, lit a little bit. Toto, toito. Toto, toto. Not sure if I have uh, heard of this guy before. Who is this? Is this Toto? Like Toto, the old Toto? Not sure if that is the D Toto. But uh, here we go. Let's take a look at uh, Roa's perspective. <coughs> Yo, Monty, thanks for the two month resub, by the way. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Ooh, we see some uh, players switching around in the top positions, actually. Pack has uh, made a huge mistake. Seven seconds loss by Pack. I'm not sure what he did. But uh, Pack now moved down to fifth. I mean, fourth. Oh. I thought my game was crashing there for a split second. But it didn't. Roa is actually uh, moving up to position 8 and uh, it is actually really close now. Only Hillis and Arizal are in a uh, tight battle for that first place. They have about 1.8 seconds difference between them but uh, the whole top 15 is actually really close. Uh, it's hard to call because they are switching around uh, every every now and then but if we take a look at Pack here who's 4th with, with 9 seconds behind and then we take a look at Marcin who is 11 seconds behind. That's only 3 second difference between these players. It is uh, good to see here on the long stretch. Uh, just the, the gap between the positions. It is nothing. Like a minor mistake will, uh, makes, will make you lose some time and lose a placing. So especially in this speed, speed section where it's uh, really needed to have the proper speed slides. You will gain a lot of speed and momentum. And if you're not doing that, that is uh, very unfortunate. But uh, Marcin driving in ninth place. Doing good. And he is actually catching up to these players here. Terry. Oh, look at Papu. The dirt player is actually uh, driving a really good dirt section. Moves up two places. Can maybe even potentially get uh, another one. In case he... In case he uh, does that <coughs> dirt section again really well. Which I'm pretty sure he will. Here we go on the booster landings. Oh, Toto hits the, hits the wall a little bit. But... Won't lose that much because you had to release uh, before that downhill section anyway. We have... Uh, <coughs> Roa actually moving up some places. And Roa can even get top 3 here if he uh, keeps on grinding his gears. We have a pretty tight battle here between Pack and Aurel. Really uh, nice to see these close battles. Between some of these really good players. Ooh, Pack has more speed entering this uh, long stretch. And he will most likely... Will most likely uh, drive away from Aurel. But Aurel is really technical. And he, his speed slides are actually really good. So let's take a look here at this left one. Oh, so close to the... The skid marks were so tiny. It's so good to see. However, Pack is driving away. Even Aurel is catching... I mean, uh, Roa is catching up to Aurel here. There he goes. On the dirt section. Where's Papu? Want to probably spectate Papu for this dirt. Jeruncha is... No, it's Marcin right in front of him. And then there's... Two more players in front of him as well. Dunsty, Toto and Flyer. So Papu can actually uh, move up a lot if he just keeps doing this dirt section good. And uh, all the other parts more mediocre. 
Oh, not the best entry exit for uh, Papu here. We'll lose a little bit of time, but let's take a look at this battle here between... Uh... Oh! Hillis has made a huge... Huh? Wait. What the fuck happened? Arizel made a huge mistake. All of a sudden, Hillis was gone out of the list. But it seems like uh, Arizel has made a huge mistake and he has dropped down from second place where he was battling it out with Hillis. Um, and now he's in, f in third. It seems, however, that Hillis has made a mistake as well because the gap between him and Pack wasn't four, sec four seconds. It was more like seven seconds. We do, however, see a new best local time. Bad Lulu sets it with a uh, 203 368 and Pack still holds 203 386. Roa 203 388. So, really, really close times here by uh, all of these 203s. Actually, up until 7th, it is really, really close. Hill is though holding strong here as uh, the players right behind him are having the battle of their lives for that second third and fourth position it is pack arizel and aurel roa is trying his best to catch up but is uh still three seconds behind and uh let's take a look at papu again on the dirt section can he overtake dust dunsty right now Oh, great speed. And that just shows Dunsty with a mistake. And Papu moves up another place in this dirt section. It is uh, definitely his favorite part of this uh, of this map, of course. And Papu moves up to 7th right now. Boom! Arizel with... I mean, Aurel with, with a new best time here. Drives a... Uh, 203.33, so it seems like the 0.3 is is the maximum here. Oh, this is so close. Look at this. Arizel and Aurel just switching back and forward. Every, every checkpoint, they are moving places. Back just right in front of him. We see Hill is in the far distance, actually. Uh, just at the end of the turn. So, it's put, that puts it in perspective. Uh, what the distances are. Ooh, huge mistake by Pack, And he will lose a lot of momentum. Roa is even catching up to him. Might even overtake him in this uh, tech section. No, Pack stays ahead. But that is a huge banger of a bangaruski mistake by Pack. And now we have an even tighter battle here. In the top places. Five seconds. Six seconds. In the top six only. So <clears throat> now it's Roa versus Pack here. The two expert drivers coming up to the full speed part. Aurel. Oh, Roa is not doing the speed slide. And there we see Pack just gaining so much more momentum. Driving away. And he will uh, catch up to Arizel a little bit. Aurel, however, is now in second. A couple rounds ago, he was holding that 7th, 8th position. But right now, he's in 2nd with only 2.9 seconds lead. I mean, disadvantage, sorry, compared to Hillis. Hillis is driving the race of his dreams here. Lap 13, we are playing 21 laps. So, over halfway complete. Can Hillis hold strong in this race? He is driving very consistent, very calm. Has figured out all the parts here. On the booster he goes. Oh no, he might flip a bit. No, actually perfect. Lands early. In the water he goes. We have uh, <coughs> oh, Papu has actually lost a little bit of uh, a little bit of time because he dropped down to place ten when he was in seventh actually. So oh my god, who was that driving upright to the pole? I mean, are you a pole dancer? Probably shouldn't play this game then. But uh, look at this man! It's such a close race. 
I don't think we've seen this uh, before in the past past editions that the race is so close. The gaps between the players. It is very nice to see here. Definitely shows that the map is uh, is really well built and not all too difficult. Difficult. We have uh, Toto in 6th place, entering the respawn right now. He is uh, 6 seconds behind the, the leader, still Hillis. On the dirt section, Toto goes. Ooh, almost clipped. I mean, he almost turned too, uh, too early there. Oh, who was that? Was that Roa? Yeah, it was Roa. Roa actually hitting the wall and... Wow, look at the times coming in. Pack. First, it's Arizo claiming the first record with a 203.31. And then Pack just shoves right in front of him with a 203.299. So, he's the first player to uh, get that sub point three here. And he is also moving up to place two. Just behind Hillis with about 2.7 seconds. 2.7 seconds is the gap between first and second. Hillis, however, I'm, I mean, uh, Arizel is uh, three seconds behind Hillis. Driving a really good race as well. Really uh, looking forward to the finish line because that's where it's going to be really uh, tight and People might even risk the end a little bit too much. Here we go. On the full speed entry. Hillis is slowly losing his uh, his lead here. 2.1 seconds now is his lead. Has to do some shenanigans in order to keep his lead or extend it even. Or he has to hope that Pack and Arizal will not uh, catch up too much. By risking some sections of this map. Lap 15 for Hillis. So he is so close to winning his first race. Probably his first uh, endurance win. Or tech tourney kind of uh, win as well. He is uh, an RPG player. So driving very consistent. Arizal with a small touch. Will lose a little bit of speed. Let's take a look at the the last player who's driving here. Uh, we have 155 players driving. I think Elephant might be the last player here. It says he's driving in 150th place. Uh, that might be true, actually. I think so, yes. So Elephant will be the last player driving. Um... We have some other players here as well. Nova, Novis Fenzik. Oh, he's from the Netherlands, actually. He's in lap 13. So he is three laps behind. He will have time to finish. We have a, uh, of course, 15 minute timer whenever the first player is finished. And uh, it's looking like Fenzik is four and a half minutes behind. So he will still be able to. He will still be able to finish. Has enough time. We have uh, BCP is actually playing. 134th at the moment. Going for a drift wall bang there. That is a uh, new strategy. On the <coughs> long stretch we go. All right. There BCP goes. Actually manages to do the full speed section well. Oh my. B Arizel has made a huge mistake. The choke of the century.
What just ha- Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh man. Rest in peace. Arizel's game crashed. Wow! What are these times coming in? First, Pack drives a 203.21. Then, Aurel drives a 202.99. 202.99. So he subbed the 203. That is impressive. And then Toto sets the new second best time by beating Pack. 203.20. Oh boy, oh boy, we have a battle going on here. Pack is actually creeping in closer to Hillis. Hillis only has a one second lead. Oh, did he touch? No, Pack didn't touch. That was so close, but it is sub one second right now. Only 9100s. Between Pack and Hillis. Is Hillis actually gonna lose this round? I mean this whole this whole map. Sorry guys, I got distracted. It is actually back creeping up closer to Hillis now. Only 3600. Is this the choke of the century by Hillis? Oh boy, oh boy, Pack is gonna pass. Pack is gonna pass Hillis. If it keeps on going like this, Hillis with a bad exit, and it is Pack in first. Hillis been driving 17 laps in first, and now he is decrowned. Oh my god, 20299. By Pack as well. He is driving like a maniac right now. And it is actually Pack. Being in first in right in front of Hillis. Oh, Pack is actually not doing the the wall bang anymore. But it's so close. 2300 between Hillis and Pack. Can Pack win this race in the end? Oh, it seems like Hillis is choking more and more now, losing loads of loads of seconds here. Pack is definitely driving away with the uh, with the better lines here. Now it's one second lead for Pack. And this is looking good for Paco here. Toto and Aurel are having a battle of their own. Right in front of uh, Aurel is Toto just entering the speed section. It is uh, very close between these two. Only 60 hundredths of a second. Oh, Aurel with a really good slide again. But uh, can he actually catch up? Or is Toto actually gonna get third place here in the ending? Aurel definitely really good on dirt as well, but uh, Toto is still ahead of him. <coughs> and the gap is not getting smaller. However, Pack is driving like a madman and wow 20263 like out of nowhere he drives so much better and some sick times coming out from pack here 20263 that is a uh, very impressive time by pack um yeah that's ridiculous two consecutive rounds in a row he just improves his time so Let's follow him for this uh, this whole round here. See what he does. He drives lap 19 right now, so two more to go. There must be some section which he just does really well. 
who is losing a lot of speed gets actually a gear down and uh hillis will capitalize on that winning 03 oh even more actually 07 of a second here on pack so pack is uh losing a little bit of time by that uh, mistake <clears throat> let's take a look here as pack is entering the speed section it must be maybe at the speed speed part where he just gets really good speed slides that wasn't so great that however is good or maybe he just gets a really good respawn who knows coming up to the dirt section one tiny mistake by pack and uh, hillis will take his place of course 1.4 seconds is the difference it is still a very close race even for the third place finish it's gonna be close because Aurel has passed uh, Toto but they are driving neck and neck back however really good dirt section will gain a lot of time again on uh, compared to Hillis here it will not be an improvement of his time he is driving his second last lap together with Hillis also and uh, the players are switching around here Toto versus Aurel as we see them here in the start this is the battle for third place that uh bronze place finish oh roa joins the party drives a 203.005 it's the third best time so really well uh well done by roa he is currently driving in position six so after that humongous mistake in lap one he is uh battling it in that sixth place Kind of driving alone on an, uh, on an island here because the player in front of him is 5 seconds uh, in front. And the player behind is about 7 seconds. So we'll most likely finish 6 here unless something unexpected happens. Aurel is uh, driving away from Toto. And we also see a uh, catastrophe for Hillis. He is now 3.8 seconds behind <clears throat> behind pack has made a small error and uh, this is more and more looking like pack will win this race and uh, Hillis will take second or even third if he uh, will choke again Aurel and Toto are not far behind so anything is possible there he goes Aurel is just now entering this turn, so. It is more and more looking like uh, the win for Pack as Aurel, I mean, Hillis touches again. We'll lose a lot of time with that. As we see, where is, where is Hillis? Hillis is just in front there. Oh, Pack with a huge mistake as well. 1.9 seconds now difference. Coming into the last lap here, guys. 1.9 seconds. One tiny mistake by Pack, and that will uh, put him into uh, a very dangerous zone, just like Hillis. This is a very tight package here with the top four, with only four and a half seconds between these players. Anything is still possible here. Ooh, who's that? Oh, I thought that was Pack, but that wasn't Pack. Where's Aurel? Aurel could even. Uh Catch up to Hillis here. It's really close. I'm not sure who I want to spectate. It's three seconds for a pack's lead. But behind Hillis, it's one second. And behind Aurel, it's also one second. So it is very, very tight here. As we come up to the tech section here. We have Aurel pushing the limits. He wants to get second. But he needs to be driving really fast. Or Hillis has to make a small mistake. Oh, but it is Aurel who is actually making the mistake. And can Toto catch up now to him? Aurel not with the best landing. Uh, I don't think Toto is actually catching up here in the slightest. So that is uh, a little bit more safer for Hillis. But Pack is definitely on his way to win the race. With a 3.7 second lead. Also is driving the best time here. 
And uh, here he goes one last time into the dirt section. Oh! No way! Pac made the same mistake, just like Hillis. Where's Aurel? Oh my god. Hillis, the choker. It is actually uh, shifting around so much. Pack is actually in his last turn here. And he will finish first. Hillis will get second place. Aurel in third. Toto in fourth. Flyer in fifth. Roa will get sixth. We have Era from Amcon finishing in seventh here. Oh. Maybe Turley overtakes him. Yes, Turley will go. No, Mus. Wait. Arrow in seven. Massa in eight. Turley ninth. Papu tenth. Yoshi eighteenth. Zburst nineteen. Pak twentieth. Bad Lulu. 21, Nod, 22nd, Yogi, 23rd, Karhu, 24th, Skugagako, 24th, oh my god, it's going too quick, I can't, wait, where's the finish line? There it is. There we go. <sighs> Funny race man just finished. Nautix finished. Zyberti finished. Razor finished. Oh, Super Peter still had a lap to go there. There we go. Oh, he gets an ignore time just in the ending. There we go. This could uh, be a uh, big finish amount, actually. Possibly 140 finishes will uh, occur here. Damn, Sprite just banged in that wall there. Just full on went in there there we go oh the banana finished the juicy banana can I put the locals on the screen yeah sure I can Pack takes it with a 202.63. RL 202.84. Alright, let's see here. Almost 100 finishes right now. Real Bus Matai will get top 100. There he goes. Paragon, 101st. Gluten Free, Mr. Gluten Free will get 102. Oh, touches the wall.
107th for Jaegerbomb. Flobber will get 108th. Jazul 109th. Crystal Place 110th. Rylum 111 finishes with five and a half minutes behind. Dr. Weather 112th. See here, BCP is uh, driving in 118th. There you go, pretty sick performance. Voldablix will uh, get 121st. Let's see here, Super Peter is still driving and uh, position 125th at the moment. Right in front of him is Snacks though. Let's see if Peter can do it in the ending. It is uh, not looking like it. Ooh, we have Blue Banu. He asked me to uh, spectate him, actually. Just installed the game before your weekly race and finished 113th. Yo, accept. That is really good. That is really good. We still have uh, a couple players driving here, around 10. Elephant is in last and uh, still has to do two more laps here. So, still has a, quite a long way to go. Let's take a look here. Sniper Knight is the next player finishing. He will be finishing 128th. Hundred and twenty-eighth for uh, Sniper Knight. There he goes, finishes. Tim Rick is going to be hundred and twenty-nine. Next, Blue Banu, 130th. <laughs> Unfair, noobing star. He's a uprising star, I guess. Has two turns to go here. He will be finishing 131st. So uh, this is going to be the third best amount of finishes. All right. Who's this? Dean. D Dean Philamore. Ooh. He has a couple turns to go, of course. If everyone manages to finish, this is going to be 134 finishes, which is really nice. 134 finishes here. There he goes. 
Next player is uh, DVA Atoma from Bulgaria. He will be getting 133rd. We have Elephant, which is going to be the last player driving. Alright, I think we need to uh, get the good old action cam right here. As we follow Elephant here. On the way. This is his last run. There he goes. In the hairpin. Boom. In the jump. What a camera action here in the looping. The speed slides. Amazing wall action. Some dirt. There he goes. Oh! There he goes. That's one turn to go. He will do it, finishing 130. <laughs> GG. 134 finishes this weekly race. This guy is just... G G 134 finishes in weekly race number 22. Peck wins it. Hill is second, Aurel third.